We want our people to go home safe every day. Robin Barfield is the Director of Safety and Risk Management at the North Carolina Department of Transportation. To ensure his employees get home safely, he's always looking at new technology, including personal protective equipment. Our personal protective equipment is our first line of defense to keep our employees safe and reduce any injuries. That includes the hard hat NCDOT employees wear every day. In the past uh, 40 years, we've gone with a traditional hard hat. Uh, which is really good for any type of blow from straight up above. But recently, Barfield and his team started a pilot program by implementing this hard hat into a few of the bridge units across the state. Added benefits to this one include a chin strap and the option to add extra PPE. And it does work. And this employee, Robert Plyler, is proof. I'm really, really glad I had that hard hat on. Plyler is a transportation supervisor, too, and does a lot of paperwork and logistics, but also joins his team in the field. On one particular day, he was repairing equipment on NC200 in Cabarrus County. On the job site, there was an incident where Plyler did suffer some injuries, including a broken tooth, but credits the hard hat he was testing for saving him from anything more severe. If I would have had a regular hard hat on, I know it would have popped it off, hands down, guaranteed, because these have chin straps, it kind of keeps that from happening. And um, I'm really glad because a tooth was fixed within three weeks, you know, of getting the permanent one in. I, I don't know, I don't know if I'd have lost an eye, but there definitely would have been a better chance of that happening. NCDOT has continued with the pilot program and has determined within the next few years, every employee that needs a hard hat will have one of these. Having your company willing to try things, that's important to me. Safety is an evolving field. It continues to change. It continues to be dynamic. And the more we embrace the changes and present them to our folks, both uh, through our educational efforts and through pilot programs such as this, uh, it makes people feel really good that we care about it.